Scott, welcome to the Home Depot Show. The Houston Texans host the Denver Broncos with a roof open in Reliance Stadium on a crisp night for the uh, mentor to come back and go against the pupil and the uh, next head coach in college football there, Mike Sherman. As for the Houston Texans, they came out throwing the ball around with Sage Rosenfels finding Andre Johnson breaking tackles, 21-yard gain. And then three plays later, Sage Rosenfels is going to take it himself. Look at the mobility this guy possesses. Get in there. Yeah, that was Vince Young-like. I thought they were drafting Vince Young here in Houston. There it is. Sage Rosenfels caps the opening drive with a, his first rushing touchdown. And then Mario Williams, that first overall pick, three and a half sacks on the night. He backs Jay Cutler here. You got a running back in protection on this guy. You're going to see him beat a running back for a sack and a tight end for a sack later. Will Demps had uh, Jay Cutler in his sights all night. Nearly picked him off several times, didn't do it here, and then he uh, punished himself as the Broncos uh, have to settle for a field goal. It's 10-6 with less than two minutes to go in the half, and there's that Will Demps again. That's why he plays defense. Oh, <laughs> wow. Prime wow. unit steps. Thank you, sir. Third quarter, still 10-6, and there's that man Mario again. Dion, he's got 12, and he's got 13 sacks on the yeah, season look now. at his speed, and Marshall talking about how he's using his hands this season. Uh, one thing about this guy, he has no quit in him. That brought up a fourth down. The Broncos go for it. Selvin Young is stopped short of a first down by Moreland Greenwood. Broncos turn it over on downs, and then Ron Dane caps the ensuing drive for Houston. 17-6 Texans, but then uh, a rare mistake on the night for Drew uh, for Sage Rosenfels as a tip ball lands in Dre Bly's hands. And that led to this. Tony Scheffler reaching out. Ball on the turf, and the Texans think they've got a turnover. Scheffler says he's got a touchdown. The refs agreed with him because after further review, the refs were right. Scheffler broke the plane before he put the ball on the turf. So it was a 17-13 game. Went on third and three, Sage Rosenfels. The fourth quarter is Sage time, people. No pressure on the quarterback there all day to throw the ball. And then Andre Johnson, after the Kevin Walter reception, puts it in the end zone. Scheffler and the Broncos know that they're in trouble as Mario Williams shuts down Jay Cutler again. Once again, he had three and a half sacks in the night as the uh, pupil is the one that goes seven and seven. And the mentors, six and eight team, now has to wonder if the 2007 season will end in the regular season as opposed to the postseason. The Texans, who would have been eliminated with a loss tonight, they are seven and seven.